Welcome to the know, I'm Meg Turney, and who's ready to live on the moon? Woo! Tyler's ready to live on the moon, I'm also ready. There's one man out there who thinks the moon is actually our celestial future, and no, he's not a laughable presidential hopeful. This man is smart, and he has a lot of money. Professor Johann Dietrich Warner is the newest president of the European Space Agency, and he's in charge of an annual budget of 4.4 million euros. So if he says we should go to the moon, eh, I'm kind of inclined to follow his lead. Speaking to the BBC this week, Warner said, We should look to the future beyond the International Space Station. We should look for a smaller spacecraft in low Earth orbit for microgravity research, and I propose a moon village on the far side of the moon. <laughs> like we just tax on a moon village, you know, go to the store, milk, eggs, coffee, moon village. It's very smooth. He goes on to say a moon village shouldn't just mean some houses, a church, and a town hall. This moon village should mean partners from all over the world contributing to this community with robotic and astronaut missions and support communication satellites. I like how it's like, you can come into our moon village, but you better bring astronauts and support satellites. There's an entrance fee. He also takes a second to throw some world-class shade at America by saying the Americans are looking to go to Mars very soon, and I don't see how we can do that. Before going to Mars, we should test what we could do on Mars on the moon. Do you hear that, America? There's a guy out there who thinks we can't do this. This is our time to shine. Quick to the fake landing simulator. His logic behind putting the red planet in a hole, by the way, does actually have its merits. He specifically mentions testing out a proposed 3D printed base of operations on the moon first before we lug it all the way to Mars. And of course, you know, should anything go wrong in Moon City, it's a lot better to be four days away from Earth than, you know, months away when you're on Mars. He would also like to welcome all nations into his Moon City and thinks that that could give us some perspective back on our pale blue dot by saying, we have enough earthly problems between different nations, space can bridge these earthly problems and the moon seems to be a good proposal. So what do you guys think? Is going to Mars way too far-fetched and we should just leave that? So we've gone to the moon. Do you want to live on the moon or are you staying here on Earth? Let us know in the comments down below. Don't forget you get the very best in video games and entertainment right here. So make sure you like this video and subscribe to this channel so you can know what we know and be in the know on this show. How are you?